and welcome to the Morning Exhale. I'm Stephanie Gaines Bryant. Let's exhale this morning by making sure you have the proper equipment. You don't need a lot of equipment. You don't need expensive equipment. But if you've got a block, and if you don't have a block, get a paper towel roll or a thick book. But if you have a block, your strap, and a blanket, it can make the difference in whether you start a yoga practice and stop or start a yoga practice and continue it for years to come. So I'm sitting on top of my blanket this morning and I'm also going to take these blocks to support my knees. The number one issue I hear people tell me about when it comes to yoga are knees. So I'm putting these blocks underneath my knees to support myself. And let's begin by rolling your shoulders forward, up, back, and down. Let's do that one more time. Rolling your shoulders forward, up, back, and down. Let's turn your head to the right. Gently lower your chin towards your shoulder. Inhale your head up. Bring your head back to center. Let's turn your head to the other side. Gently tilt your chin towards your shoulder. Inhale your head up. Bring your head back to center. Let's stretch your arms out to the side. Press your right hand into the floor. Inhale your left arm up and overhead. Then exhale, release. Let's do the other side. Inhale, lifting up and overhead. Exhale, release. Now let's lift and lower your left and right arms, just making a gentle sweeping motion across the ceiling. The next time your right arm is lifted, hold it there. Then I want you to lower your head. I want you to bring your head looking towards your knee and then inhale, looking up toward your palm. Exhale, looking at your knee. Inhale, looking up at your palm. Exhale, look down at your knee. Inhale, look up at your palm and release. Let's do the other side, lifting up and overhead. Exhale, look down at your knee. Inhale, look up at your palm. Exhale, look down at your knee. Inhale, look up at your palm. Exhale, look down at your knee. Inhale, look up at your palm and release. Very good. Let's remove the blocks from underneath your knees and you can remove your blanket as well. Let's bring the soles of your feet to the floor. Bring your hands behind you. Lower your knees to the left. Come back to center. Lower to the right. Come back to center. Lower to the left. Let's bring your body all the way around into an upward twist. Then exhale, we're going to move in the other direction, bringing your body all the way around into an upward twist. Exhale, untwist. Let's come to the front of your mat, and we're going to bring your hands underneath your thighs, lift your chest, lean back, coming into upward boat. Then let's roll on down to your back. Press your heels to the ceiling for dead bug. Reach your fingers toward your big toes. Breathe. Let's bend your knee into your chest like you're really hugging that knee in. 
Then we're going to gently lower your left leg, or just a few inches at a time. Lower it a few inches. Lower a few more inches. Then let that heel hover just above the mat. Lift up your head, lift up your chest, draw your nose in towards your knee. Breathe. Then let's switch. Let's switch. Then switch. And release. Let's bring the soles of both feet to the floor. Bring your arms down by your side, and you can step your heels in just a little bit closer to your backside. On an inhale, scoop up your hips. Exhale, release your hips down. Inhale, scoop up your hips. Exhale, release your hips down. Inhale, scoop up your hips. Exhale, release your hips down. Let's stretch both legs out. We're going to bring your arms up and overhead. Let's take your right hand, grabbing onto your left wrist, point your toes, press your heels into the mat, press your lower back into the mat. Breathe. Then release. Bring the soles of your feet to the floor once more. Arms down by your side. This time when we lift up your hips, lift up your arms. Inhale, lifting up your arms, lift up your hips. Exhale, release your arms, release your hips. Inhale, lifting up your arms, lift up your hips. Exhale, release your arms, release your hips. One last time, inhale, lifting up your arms, lift up your hips. This time I want you to squeeze your buns together and lift your hips a little bit higher. Gently lower your hips back down to the mat Stretch both legs out. This time, you're going to take your left hand, grab onto your right wrist, point your toes, press your heels and your lower back into the mat, and breathe. Then release. With your right arm stretched out, we're going to roll over onto your right side. Then let's come up onto your right forearm, draw your knees into your chest. Let's take your top hand, we're grabbing onto your hip, or we're gripping your hip, and we're just going to lift and lower your knee. Then release. Let's take your hand. We're bringing your left hand to your shoulder. Circle forward. Pause. Circle back. Then release. Now let's take your top hand. We're bringing that hand to the mat. And we're stretching that top leg out. Let's circle forward. Pause. Circle back. Very good. And release. Keep that leg extended. We're going to bring your top arm up and overhead. Now we're going to bring your hand and foot together. Inhale up. Exhale down. Inhale up. Exhale down. Inhale up. 
exhale down and release. Now I want you to use that left hand. You're pushing yourself back up to center and let's roll over on to the other side. Let's begin by stretching that top leg out. Bring your hand down to the mat. Let's circle forward. Pause, circle back. Now let's bring one knee on top of the other. Use your hand to grip your hip and we're just lifting and lowering your knee for clamshells. Let's take your hand, bring your hand to your shoulder, circle forward. Pause, circle back. Let's take your hand, bring that hand all the way up and overhead, stretching your leg out once more. And then we're gonna bring the hand to the foot, then arm up and overhead, inhale up, exhale down, inhale up, exhale down, one knee on top of the other. Let's bring your hand down to the mat and I want you to push yourself up and we're gonna come up to table pose. Let's begin with some cat and cow. Round your back, chin to chest, drop your tailbone for cat. Inhale your head up, drop your abdomen down, lift your tailbone for cow. So let's do some cat and cow at your own pace just lifting and lowering in a way that feels good to your spine. Come to a neutral spine. We're gonna come up onto both knees and I want you to bring your hands to your sacrum area, curl your back toes under and we're gonna lean back for camel pose. If you'd like to grab onto your heels, feel free to do so or not. Inhale, coming up. I'm gonna grab my blocks. You can grab your blocks if you'd like. We're gonna bring that, those blocks to the front of the mat and then I want you to stretch your right leg out behind you. We're just moving forward and back bringing some stretch to your calf, your arch, your heel. Then on an exhale, bend into your knee. We're gonna bring your foot in between the blocks. Let's drop your left knee back a little bit if that's more comfortable for you. Then let's straighten, bend, these are seesaws. Straighten, bend, straighten, and bend. Bring your knee to a neutral position. Then let's inhale your arms up to V position. Let's take your left hand, bring it to the outside of your right knee, coming into a side stretch. Inhale, lengthen both arms up. Exhale, bring your hands back down to the blocks. Let's curl your back toes under, lift up your knee, and then we're gonna step that left foot forward. Inhale, lifting all the way up, palms together, exhale. Down to your heart center, soften your knees, bring your hands down to the blocks. This time we're stepping the right foot back, Lower your heel down, uncurl your toes, sweep your arms up to V position. 
Exhale, bring those hands down back to the blocks. Then we're going to do seesaws, moving that knee forward, then back, forward, back, forward, and back. Let's bring your knee to a neutral position. Curl those right toes under, lift up your knee, Step that back leg up, and we're going to roll up one vertebrae at a time. Let your head be the very last thing to come up to center. And I'm adjusting my mic. Very good. And once you've come up to center, let's roll your shoulders forward, up, back, and down. Let's do that one more time. Rolling your shoulders forward, up, back, and down. Let's inhale your arms all the way up, palms together, exhale, down to your heart center. This time, soften your knees, stretch your arms out. Inhale all the way up, palms together, Exhale, down to your heart center one more time. Soft knees, stretch the arms out. Bring your fingertips together. Lower your left arm down by your side. Reach your right arm up and overhead. Inhale, coming up. Bring your fingertips together. Let's lower your right arm down by your side. Reach your left arm up and overhead. Inhale, coming up to mountain pose. Relax your shoulders. Your feet are firmly grounded to your mat. Breathe. Now let's bend your knees, arms parallel to your ears for chair pose. Let's sweep your arms to the right. Come back to center, sweep to the left, center, slowly rise up, palms together, exhale, down to your heart center, very good. Let's separate your feet, your toes are turned forward, then we're going to turn your toes to the right, bend into your knee, your hips are squared to the side, stretch your arms out, for side warrior, breathe. Now let's take your forearm, bring that forearm down just above your knee. Bring your back arm up and overhead. Inhale, coming up. And we're going to drop that left arm down, lift the right arm up, coming into reverse warrior. Breathe. Now let's come back to side warrior pose. I want you to take that left arm, bring it forward, bend at the elbows. Drop your left elbow down. Bring your right elbow over, coming into eagle arms. Exhale forward. Inhale, lifting up. Exhale forward. Inhale, lifting up. Exhale forward. Inhale, lifting up, release, uncross. Let's straighten out that front leg, pivot forward, then we're going to pivot in the other direction. Hips are squared to the side, you're bringing your big toe in just about an inch, stretching your arms out to the side, we're looking over your left fingertips. Breathe. Then we're going to bring your forearm down just above your knee. Lift your back arm up and overhead for side angle pose. Inhale, we're lifting all the way up to reverse warrior. You're looking up at your left palm. Breathe. Let's come back to side warrior pose. We're bringing your right arm forward, bend at the elbows. Drop that right elbow down, bring the left elbow over, coming into eagle arms. Exhale forward. 
Inhale, lifting up. Exhale, forward. Inhale, lifting up. Exhale, forward. Inhale, lifting up. Release. Then we're going to take your hands. Bring your hands back down to the blocks. We're bringing your foot in between the blocks. And let's do standing seesaws. Straighten. Bend. Straighten, bend, straighten, and bend. Step your back foot up. We're going to switch. Standing seesaws. Straighten, bend, straighten, bend, straighten, and bend. Then we're going to lower your left knee down to the mat and slide the other leg back. Let's bring those blocks to the side. I want you to drop your left knee back and then the right knee back and lower your hips down. Bring those elbows next to your side. We're slowly lowering down to your belly. Those elbows are next to your sides. Your big toes touch. Scoop your pelvis into the mat. Press into your palms. We're lifting up to cobra. Then release. Let your body melt down onto the mat. We're just going to wiggle your hips a little bit right and left. Now let's come up onto your forearms. Your palms are down. Your big toes touch again, scooping your pelvis into the mat. On an exhale, we're lowering your rib cage down. Inhale, lifting up to this baby back bend. Exhale, lower down. Inhale, lifting up. Exhale, lower down. Inhale, lifting up. Let's hold this for five breaths. Then release. Very good. Let's bring your palms next to your chest, elbows hugged in. This time, we're pressing all the way up into upward dog. Press into your knees. Pushing back into child's pose. Sitting back toward your heels, arms stretched out in front of you. Breathe. Coming back up into table pose, we're lowering your left or right hip down, swinging around. Coming back into a seated position. Let's bring your hands to your knees. Roll your shoulders forward, up, back, and down. Rolling your shoulders one more time. Forward, up, back, and down. Let's bring up your left hand. We're having your pinky out and your thumb will be out. And the other fingers are curled in. So we're taking your left thumb. We're bringing it to your left nostril. Exhale out of the right nostril. Inhale. Switch. Exhale. Inhale. Switch. Exhale. Inhale. Switch, exhale, inhale, switch five times at your own pace. Exhale, inhale, switch.
after your fifth breath, bring your hands down to your knees. Close your eyes now. Let's go inside. We're slowing it down now. Taking in a nice, deep, full breath. Noticing your, how your body feels after the practice. Noticing how you feel after Nadi Shodna, which is the single nostril breath. Just notice how you feel from head to toe. Just notice. Nadi Shodna is a relaxation breath. It's a calming breath. So let's begin calming the rest of your body. Just allowing your body to relax as you sit, softening your toes, your left foot, then your right foot. Relaxing your legs, softening your thighs, relaxing your hips, softening each and every muscle in your back. Notice the rise and fall of your chest as you breathe. Notice your abdomen as you breathe. Relax your shoulders and your arms, softening each and every finger. Relax the muscles along the sides of your neck, Soften your jaw. Separate your teeth. Relax your eyelids. Notice the feeling of relaxation from the crown of your head all the way to the soles of your feet. Begin bringing your awareness back into the room. Bringing small movements to your toes and your fingers. Nodding your head right and left. Open your eyes, letting your eyes greet the light on this glorious morning. Stretch your arms out. Inhale all the way up. Palms together. Exhale with a sigh. Ah. Thanks for joining me for the morning exhale. I'm Stephanie Gaines Bryant. Namaste.